I recently finished a new painting of historic New York City. The National Maritime Historical Society has offered it for sale and I'd like to show it to you. So this is the painting of New York in 1899. It's the view from, I don't know, let's say a drone hovering over the Hudson River between New York and New Jersey. And you can see over the island of Manhattan, you can see the bridge, Brooklyn Bridge, newly constructed over there on the East River. I do an awful lot of research to create a painting like this. It starts with old prints, these old bird's eye views seem to show every building in Manhattan. Old maps, lots of old photos of New York, the buildings themselves, as well as a lot of maritime research. This is the spire of Trinity Church, which is still there at the end of Wall Street on Broadway. Uh, for a long time, it was quite a landmark in New York because it was about 27 stories tall, which was very tall in those pre-elevator days in New York. Uh, but it can be very difficult to spot these days among all the towering skyscrapers. This structure that looks like a smokestack was actually a shot tower. It's over there near where the South Street Seaport is today. Uh, let's see, this is the old Western, Western Union uh, building that's on was on Broadway that's been torn down now and replaced by a much much larger Western Electric building. The spire St. Paul's is still there on Broadway. And this is an old steamship named the Young America that I have found in many old prints of the era, which I thought would make a good name for the painting, so I've called the painting Young America, New York in the 1890s. Now we are this is right about where the World Trade Center, the Freedom Tower is today, this area right in here, I think where that is.